Goat's back on the long drive. How are you guys doing? We have a myriad of problems we must deal with. One, we don't have a door, but that's not a huge problem. Two, we have something sticking out of here that we don't need. This, this is trash. Uh, we don't have a radiator. And three, we raised $1,105, um, I believe it was, for our campaign. Now, I'm not sure I can stream again or have the time to stream again. Prior to the end of Thankmas. So I think that's going to be it for the Thankmas streams. But I think I'll continue streaming. I think it's something that people seem to enjoy. And uh, I'm not sure I'm any good at it. But I can work on my streaming skills. Get more pop-ups and fun things going on there. I think we could have a lot of fun with it if we wanted to. And then I can do it around my work schedule. Because it's really not that hard to do. It just uses up every single amount of my time. Why is there no hunger bars? I keep start. Okay, let me save this. Save. Okay, let me go back to the main menu. Exit, main menu. Hunger and thirst are checked. So why is it not showing up? This is a really good question. Because, let me see. Um, is it one of those things where, like, you have to change off... Oh, here we go. Always show health points, food, water. Always. There we go. We'll do this. Okay. Let's, uh, let's load that back up. Sorry. Got a little, look at my save games here. It's got a little, a uh, little out of control. Uh, let's see. Where did I save it? Oh, is this, is this it? Okay. We'll load this. There we go. We'll see if this is good. Jeez. What a day so far. <laughs> I like to show as many mistakes as possible. Um, and I had, to, I had to load the multiplayer version to do the stream today, which is a whole new version of the game. You have to use the beta branch on uh, Steam. So hopefully, oh, there, it's all back. Nice. That's why I can't, I can't eat. I got to poop. There we go. Okay, perfect. All right, we got that in us. Um, so we're going to have to proceed down the road here and hope to find... Something we can stop at that might give us a radiator. Um, and that's going to be hard to try to do 50 kilometers. So we may not make 50 kilometers today, but we're going to do our best to try. So the car is completely cooled off at this point. We need to drink a water. We should probably check how much water I have left in this container. Um, I recently filled it, so it should be pretty good. But I can't believe you raised eleven hundred dollars, and then we're able to go over to another stream afterwards of this young uh, Indian woman and donate a bunch of money to her stream, and it started a whole donation thing, and she ended up getting like twelve hundred dollars. So good on her, you know. Excellent, and and I love uh, I can't remember her name. It starts with an I. I can't remember now, and I do apologize. Also, in the stream the other day, somebody mentioned. Is that a rabbit? <laughs> somebody mentioned a Canadian streamer, a woman. Uh, her name started with an L, I believe, and I, I, I got to go back through the stream and find out because I would like to get in contact with her uh, about doing a uh, a Canadian stream at some point. She may be way bigger than me and not want to. I don't know, but I would like to know because I just think it'd be kind of cool to have two Canadians doing their thing because we're, we're all very friendly up this way, but we're currently we're looking for a... A radiator, because this thing's just going to keep overheating until we do. So that's our next big plot development. But I don't see anything useful at the moment. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no. That's that's wrong. That's wrong. Okay. I don't like being this long grass going fast, because sometimes there's rocks in here. Great. This is when it overheats. Right when I'm here, where I'm going my slowest possible. Great. Well, you know what? Oh, we forgot to... Oh, my goodness. Forgot to reset the odometer. But I know where I stopped, so we're fine. <sighs> and I still got out on the kilometers from the other day's live stream. Which was 107, so... Well, 100 and... 100 and uh, 102, actually. Okay, this is going terribly, terribly slow. It looks like there's something in the distance there. Okay, do we have a heat gauge here? I think we, there it is. That's got to be the heat gauge, right? Oh, yeah, because it slowly goes up. Yeah, that's definitely the heat gauge. 
So let's ride it out like this for a bit until we get where we're going. Looks like we may have something way in the distance over here. But I'm not sure. So we're just going to have to keep doing this. So we need to get to like 152 on this odometer. Um, if we expect to make any headway, it's not going to be fast. <laughs> oh my goodness. Why Why is this a thing right today? I just, you know what? Sometimes you get involved in these things. And you're going to yourself, why? Why, why did you do this to yourself? What, what happened? What happened to your... You're all good and then you ruined it. So, yeah. <laughs> this is where we're at in our life. That's cooled off a little bit. Let's see, here we go. We gotta kill it right before it dies. That's the whole thing, because it bogs down the engine and you slow down suddenly. So you want to keep that maximum speed, but, it, but thanks to everybody who donated and spent time watching the stream. It's very, very much appreciated. Such a good cause, you know, and it's great that you guys were there to do so. My donation page is still open if you feel like, uh, go over to, go to, the link is in the description of the video to our, our Tiltify thing. So if you still feel like donating, you're welcome to over there. You suddenly become rich, you know, just feel, just feel free. <laughs> But no, it was a great, great success, and I am super happy uh, that we made it as far as we did with it. It, it, it. In four days of streaming, we pulled it off, and it was really, really cramping my uh, my schedule, so like at least that part of it worked out. Well, look at this. We got some headway. A little leeway there. All right, excellent. We just need a little radiator. That's all we need. Just a little bit of radiator. A little radiator to put in there. Maybe something with some hair. But doo 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 doo. Now this looks like a potential for a radiator place. But knowing our luck, no. So But it will give us a real potential to have a have a nap. Ooh, okay. Let's just, just motor through it here. Oh, we can make it there before this overheats, right? Probably not, but that's fine. We're going to get there anyway. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm going to stop this exactly at 150, and that way I know somewhat of where I am. And it leaves it as a... An even number that's easy to calculate. All right, let's uh, let's have a sleep. Hopefully, no rabbits come walking in my door. Okay, this is uh oh, there's a car around the corner. Maybe it's got a rad. Preferably a functional one and not one that's all rusted out. No, every time I find a car, it's a Trabant with no radiator. Like what? What? Why? Why? Don't fall on me, fool. Like every car, do you know what else I've noticed too? My mods aren't hooked up. I just realized that. I'm gonna fix that too. See what happens when you switch versions of the game? So I'm gonna have to get my mods all hooked back up as well. So sorry about that. What are you, what am I eating? I don't even know what that was. We do a giraffe knee though. God, I don't want the Trabant. Is there anything here? God, I could fabricate a radiator for the amount of time I spent looking for this one. Oh, yeah, we slept. So the radiator's good. Is there, is there a field door? Okay, everything should be closed. Hopefully we can get somewhere near the next stop and find freaking Trabants. They're everywhere. This is about the third or fourth Trabant I've run into when I've had radiator problems. And it's always like, hey, here's a Trabant. Swap out to this. No, it's a terrible car. Like, it's a really terrible car. But oh boy, this thing heats up quick. <laughs> but yeah, obviously my mod stopped working, so I'm going to have to reinstall the, the mod loader. But that's all right. I didn't even think that... To, I never think to check that prior to... Uh, starting this recording but it's good to know half our heat is there okay hopefully we can find something though because like geez oh okay whoa, whoa whoa okay we caught the edge of that 
Okay. There's a rock right there. I saw that. Okay, here we go. How are we doing from a heat perspective? Oh, we're just about out of it. So why don't we... How fast are we going? Pretty good. Pretty good. 160? Let's kill the ignition. Oosh, okay. Watch over that rock. Coast for a little while and see if we can't find... Well, looks like we got something coming up here, but generally places like, like gas stations don't have radiators. And I don't care what kind of radiator it is. Bus radiator, car radiator. Don't care. Maybe those uh, air intakes are functional and it's sucking cool air into the engine and cooling it down as we speak. I highly doubt it, but, you know, there's always the hope. Oh, is that a house? Oh, that might have a radiator. There's a good chance there's a car parked in the back that is built. What do I got here? You know what? Let's let's just risk it. Worst case, we have uh, a little overheating problem. Oh no! God, that's a tree. Whoops. Whoops. Well. Problems were had. Excuse me for a minute while I go pontificate about this. And by pontificate, I mean use the bathroom. Just give me one moment. Okay, we're back. I had to warn books not to use that bathroom for a while. Because I'm a polite man. Oh god, we're not going to make it. Come on. Okay. Ignition off. Now please let there be a radiator here, for the love of all that is holy. I've had a lot of radiator problems recently. Okay, let's just slow her up. Okay, there's a car in there. My guess- oh god, is it a- Oh, it's a wagon. Oh, nice. Alright, hop out. Radiator? Oh god, why does it gotta be a crusty ass terrible radiator? Why can't it be something half decent? Ugh! I'm so mad I'm gonna throw beds. Ugh! <laughs> Traffic cone. Cookie? I'm gonna eat the cookie because I'm sad. Alright. I'm naked and fat and sad. I don't know where to find what I need. Looking for a stupid rad. Everything's not working out for me. Don't understand why I can't find a rad. They're everywhere. This is a door. I wish I could find it so I could go down the road some more. I'm naked and fat and sad. I found some water. Gonna drink it cause I am bad. That purifying water. Guess we'll take this crappy rad. It's all we got. It's making me sad. Why can't I just be happy? But I can't because the game hates me. Okay. I'm going to take this and I'm going to put this in this crappy radiator. And it's not going to cool worth the crap, but it might give us a chance to get to the next stop. Now, this is getting dangerously low on water. And I should have filled it up at the last... Uh, stop there, but I didn't. But we still have 6.2 li- We still have 6.2 liters of water, which is enough for a good-sized drink and filling a completely new radiator. Now, we don't want this falling out the back, so I need you to go into- Stop it! There we go. So you got five liters in you, but you're not gonna last long, because it's gonna overheat anyway, but it might prolong the overheating process. Until we can find a little better radiator. All right, let's see. How are we doing? Yeah, that rad's not going to last long. But it'll be better, like I said, than not having a radiator at all. We may have to travel at night. When it's a bit cooler out. Now, that would be a nice addition to the game. An ambient temperature gauge. So you knew what kind of temperature it was out. So you knew if your radiator would be functioning well that day or not. Yeah, she's creeping up, but creeping up slower than it was before. 
All right, we just got to get to 150 kilometers on this odometer. That's what we're going to call our day here. Then add that 150 to the next uh, the next uh, thumbnail, and that way I can kind of count the. Oh, there's a rabbit. No, I should have stole the door. Because it would have been nice to have a door, so the rabbits just can't lunge in here and attack me. But hey, you know what? I don't know what I'm doing most of the time. Yeah, the rad's hanging on for now. This is nice. Okay, so we just got to find a little better radiator in one door. Thank God there's those abandoned houses that have cars, because I'll tell you. But I want to get my mods be reinstalled, because I still want to find that V8. That means I've lost my turbo, which sucks. Okay, okay, okay. We got a double building in the distance. I never even thought about the mods, how they'd be affected by reinstalling the game. I never even thought about that. This is stupid on my part. Okay, dude, get back on the road, please. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Perfect. Okay, so we're cruising hard now. Uh, that radiator is going to be leaking, though, so... Somewhere to stop and get water would be nice. And fill up our water containers, and we should be good to go for a while. I saw a double building out there. Whether or not we cross its path or not, they always, they always have water at the double building. So we are ready to rock and roll. And then I'm going to order Arby's so I can feel sick to my stomach no matter how good it is. All right. Okay, here's a double building coming up. They always have water, but I'm, we're, I'm not sure we're crossing its path, but I guess we'll find out as we drive by. And then we can check the water level of that radiator. Because if we can just keep it stocked until we find a new one, that's fine as well. Uh, what a day. The stream went so well today, though. So I think I am going to start streaming on the regular. Uh, if you guys are okay with that. I don't want to put you down for watching too much of my content. Let's put it that way. I don't want to be that guy. I was thinking about maybe doing RimWorld on a live stream. Because it's a fairly uh, friendly game for live streaming, I think. From the looks of it. And I really enjoy RimWorld. I like doing weird colonies in RimWorld. Like, really weird colonies. Like, I had a colony once that did nothing but upgrade this one poor dude that had uh, dementia with cybernetic implants. And he kept going crazy and killing everybody. And it was really funny. I liked that game. That was a good one. So I'll bet you that that radiator's down by like at least half a liter or more by now. But there'll be water here we can put into our container, so this will be a good spot to stop and kind of hang out. Jesus, real bouncy. Okay. 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 What do we got here? Oh, tanker truck. All right. This building looks more haggard than normal. All right. Mission off, and we'll pop out and see what's going on. Let, let me out. Okay. We're going to bring this because we're going to fill that with water. What's in you? Ah, uh, just diesel. Nothing worth it. All right. Now, which building was it that has it? Is it the other? I think it's the other one. But we should probably look out for a new radiator while we're here. Because sometimes they'll be just strewn on the floor or whatever, so. But it's not that common. Let's see. Should be water in this back room here. Yeah, here we go. Okay. Okay, let's open. Where's the opening? Oh, there it is. Okay, here we go. Got to put it right about there. Okay. I gotta line this up. Oh, it, it's kind of going in. There. All right, jack it up. Fill my jug. There we go. Okay. I don't want to do it too fast, you know. Just a big old waste of water. And done. Okay. I kind of wonder if you can put water in the toilets. Do you think that's a thing? Hang on a sec. All right, let's... Does it come out the back? No, okay. Apparently you can't put water in the toilets. That's a sad day. I just got to tell you. All right. See, a man sees a toilet. He wants to put water in it. Or poop. Or, or pee. You know, one of those three things definitely wants to be in the toilet. All right. We got our water filled back up. No, you got to get in there right, bro. You got to get, 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 get your head right, bro. Get in there. Okay. 
Oh my goodness. Like, wh why? Why, why, why? And I gotta go check the radiator. By do I'm gonna go check it. It's gonna be half empty. I'm gonna feel stupid. Oh no, it's not leaking too bad. So we're doing all right there. So maybe we don't have to look for a new radiator here. There we go. All right, so we got about 20 kilometers to cover, which isn't bad. I'm just so ha so impressed with the community and raising all that money. Though it was just, it was crazy. A couple of those times, like, I said it before, and I said it a couple of times during the stream, like, I intended to raise $100. Like, that was my goal. And to raise over 1100 is crazy. I think we're the number 12 streamer on uh, Jacksepticeye's thing right now. At one point, we were like 8th or ninth, Like, it was crazy. But, you know, like I said, when the big guys show up, it's it's all over for us. We'll disappear off that leaderboard faster than anybody in history. But the fact that even for a few days, someone who read that read my name just kind of blows my mind. It should blow your mind as well. Have your mind blown. I'll give you a moment. Did it blow? All right, cool. So whoever survived, yeah, it was an amazing moment. An absolutely amazing moment. Ooh, look, grass. Okay, I like this. This area looks like it's been burned or something, or like a, almost like a beach. I don't know what's going on here, but I kind of like it. Got the whole fan family in the back, so that works out pretty good. And I think that, like, I'm exhausted from all the streaming and doing and stuff, and... All that, but uh, I think it was worth it, you know. I think it's totally worth it. Oh, geez, a little, little, little burp there. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Like, I think I, I think the money we raised produces like four walls in one of these homes. So when someone's touching their wall, it's going to be because of us. How cool is that? Whoa, stay on the road, fool. Oh, nope, 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 no. Whoa, watch it. This is going, this suddenly is starting to go very well and I'm a little bit disturbed, like something's about to happen. This isn't normal for me, what, what's happening? Yeah, this isn't right, something's gonna go bad. You can't trust a game like this. When everything's going smooth, that means something's wrong. You just don't know it yet. Something should be happening devastatingly wrong all the time. And if it's not, you're probably going to be in trouble in a very short period of time. <laughs> yeah, but I think live streaming is something that uh, I can improve upon and do a bunch of stuff on and, and be happy that it's uh, that it's happening and i think that uh i'm like i'm not much of a streamer because i don't have that type of personality where you know in the moment kind of stuff but it seems to be working out and people seem to tune in so if people want to tune in i'll stream boy this thing this thing's smooth as silk right now and I've got headlights. It's even better. Okay, there. Oh, big rock. Okay. Can't trust those big rocks, man. Creep on you out of nowhere. Oh, I hear some wind blowing. I still haven't come across a sandstorm on the road yet. And as much as I played this game, you think it would happen. Okay, nothing. Is there nothing? All oh, this is very scary to me. <laughs> yeah, like we're just suddenly cruising miles and miles. A, no buildings, and B, no accidents, and it's just slightly turning nighttime. Huh. Oh, we got something here. What's this? I see that little house hiding back there. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, we're going to pull in here and get a better rad. See what they got going on here. Oh, we got a, just a wrecked car. All right, well, we'll pull in, have a little break, a little schnooze. Turn the ignition off. Why can't I sleep yet? Oh, there we go. Perfect. 
I don't like driving during the nighttime with only one door. Some rabbit could just jump in there from the side sidelines. All right, cool. All right, let's hop out for a second, see what's up here. Okay. Well, there's another pickup truck here. And where there's pickup trucks, sometimes there's parts. Nope. Nothing here. Okay, there's, there's some chocolate up here. I can eat that. Chocolate, please. Thank you. Okay. We got a bucket of alcohol, water, and blood, which we don't need. What's this? Oh. Does anybody else hear the hear? Oh, I hear a UFO. I hear you. I know your truth. That's not a red one. Is people always tell me I've met the red UFO, but I've never seen a red UFO. Well, this is a door, but it's definitely the wrong side door. Um. I think it's the right door. No, it's not the right door. It's not the right door. Is that the right door? Or is that the rabbit door? No, that's the right door. It's just the right door. <laughs> Even the right color, too. Oh, God. Now, I don't see anything we're stopping for here. I think we're pretty much over this spot. Let's get out of here before the rabbits start creeping. Um, road? Oh, jeez, I'm driving away from it. Christ. Oh, oh, this is not necessary. See you around. All right. There it is. All right, here we go. Perfect. Okay, let's go for a little more cruise down the road. We're not too far from our goal of 150 kilometers. Uh, and that includes the live stream stuff, because I don't add it until the next episode, just because it's easier that way. Well, we're going the wrong way. Jacket. Jacket on it, jacket it, jackety jack. Smacking it, slapping it, slappity slap. Okay. Where the sun always shines, he's about to jack it. South Park. Another great show. All right. So we just got to beat the beans out of this thing for another probably couple of minutes and we should be at our goal and i appreciate the fact that you guys have stuck in here through this episode of one million episode of the long drive <laughs> yeah i'm not exciting guys i'm just waiting for mon bazoo and uh my winter car to come out what is this now oh it's like a bus stop again well i don't need a bus i have a car and it's terrible but it's going to get the job done. Okay, 143. There you go. Be gentle. Be gentle on it. Gentle. Nice. All right, so all you got to do is go up and around this bend. Maybe another five kilometers after that, and you should be good. This, see, this is what I like. A few little bits of drama, nothing too serious, and then just cruising. Just a solid cruising day. I used to know somebody's last name cruising. Spelled completely differently, but it was still it was still their last name. Okay, what do we got here? Okay, this is good. We're just gonna blow through this like I don't know. Um a clown at a at a, a balloon party? <laughs> Does that make sense? Gonna blow through this like a clown at a balloon party? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Okay. Balloons of cocaine. Okay, no, that's not that's not that's not even fun. Okay, so I'm just gonna keep driving. And we're just gonna just haul butt down this way until we get to the promised land, which is about mm, 30 or so lampposts away. <laughs> and then we'll be there. Like like 28 lampposts or something like that. There we are, okay. This is good. Now, some of them told me they reckon these uh, lampposts are about 100 meters apart. And I think the one thing me and Rob lacked to do in the live stream was try to do a 100 meter dash between those poles to see who would win. But he kept being creepy coming out of the darkness, and it freaked me out. Okay, this is. This is a. It was so much fun playing with Rob today. It really was. Okay. 
Oh my god, I know you can do this. You can pull the ashtray out? Cool. I don't smoke right now. Okay. Oh, we only got 40 meters to go. Ow, 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 ow. Yeah, Mont Bazoo looks pretty good. Well, okay. Okay. You know what? That's enough. We'll spin to completion. Let's see. Did we get it? Yep, we did. All right. So we're going to park off the road. Okay. Ignition off. Nice. Oh. No! Too many rabbits! Die, fool! All the horizon rabbits must die. Is that it? We all done here, boys? Okay. Excellent. So I'm going to leave this episode here. So thank you so much for watching. And thank you for all your support lately while I've live streamed and all that and the mistakes that have happened and all those things. Super duper appreciate it. Uh, if you like this episode, please leave a comment. Maybe subscribe. Uh, maybe get your dog to subscribe. Maybe get your horse to subscribe. And if you didn't like this, well, you should probably find yourself a real YouTuber because I am not much of one. Thank you again so much for watching. Love every view I get. Scapegoat! Books really loves Arby's and it creeps me out. Out.